Hello, welcome back to the Ministry of Biscuits. My name is Becky and today I'm going to show you how to create the perfect line icing to decorate your biscuits. I'm going to be taking you through our classic recipe using Royal Icing Mix, which you can purchase at most supermarkets now. If you don't have these ingredients and are looking for an alternative recipe, have a look on our blog, which is in the description below. So let's get started. Once you've placed your icing mix in your bowl, we're going to start with three tablespoons of water. Then just gently mix in the water so it combines with your royal icing mix. At this point, if you wanted to use a hand mix, you definitely can. Just be careful that you don't walk away as you can over mix your icing. And just keep mixing till it's all combined and we're looking eventually for the consistency of toothpaste. If you're finding that the mixture isn't quite coming together, go ahead and add a little bit more water. Just don't get too carried away. Add a couple of drops at a time. And then just keep mixing and combine all together. You're looking for a nice smooth, thick consistency. As you can see, the consistency is nice and thick, just enough to fall off the spoon. Before I transfer my line icing into a piping bag, I'm going to add some colour. Here at the Biscuiteers, we use gel food colouring to colour all of our icing. We find it gives a really strong colour. If you can't find these in the supermarket, head over to our icing store on the website where you can purchase all the colours. The great thing about using gel food colouring is that you only need a really small amount and you can get a nice range of colours. Here I am using a toothpick to scoop out a really small amount and then just take that and mix it into your icing. Then use your spoon again just to combine that colour through your icing. Just gently work it through your line icing until all the colour is combined. And you'll see the mix and the colour is appearing quite fast. And just keep going until all that colour is nice and even. To transfer the line icing into your piping bag, you're going to need a jar or a glass and then you'll push your bag into the centre and roll the edges over the sides. Once you've placed your bag in your jar, take a spoonful of your line icing, push it into the bag and you can use the bag to scrape it off your spoon. You want to fill your bag about two thirds full and then you can roll the bag up and just work the icing down to the bottom, pushing it down towards the end, working up any air bubbles and leaving yourself enough room at the top to tie a nice secure knot. Once you've tied the knot in the end of your bag, you're all ready to start icing with your perfect line icing. If you'd like to learn more tips and tricks of biscuiteering, hit the subscribe button below. In the meantime, we'd love to chat with you over on our Instagram page, which is linked below. See you again soon. Bye.